Greetings, my name is Frozen, and today we are gonna take a look at the new Mega Maker patch 1.5. I've been waiting for this one for quite some time now. Yeah, why are we looking at this color vomit here? Um, well, I've basically placed some of the new tiles. I'm actually gonna add some, some to the bit of a showcase thing I've been working on. And yeah, I've just thrown things together here. There are lots of new tiles. Some new... Actually, I need to not kill them as fast. Because that really didn't show anything, huh? Well, anyways, yeah. This one's interesting. Yep. Hello? Yep. So, it actually opens for quite some long time. It's a pretty easy enemy. Which is honestly, well... Uh, kind of refreshing though. And then, right, we have new, uh, lots of new weapons. I'm gonna show them as well, but here's... Uh, well, here's my new favorite gimmick and I made probably the worst possible showcase for it. Anyway, I'm gonna show different weapons now instead. Yes, we have a ball we can kick. This is gonna be used for so many puzzle levels I can see it already. Then we have a really nice tool. Also really good for Metroidvania stuff. Overall, these weapons like this is, well, I mean, I mean, all of these are so good for Metroidvania stuff that Man, this is maybe my favorite patch ever. Okay. Although the amount of stuff that has come in this update is pretty ridiculous, that also helps. And we have a sword. We have the concrete block that was also shown on Twitter like the sword was. Anyway, maybe I can not die. Yeah. It's not as controllable as like you would think, but yeah, it's really cool. And you can chain them, yeah. It always goes to a certain distance, that's a good thing to keep in mind. Even though you are right next to it when you start it, okay? I actually haven't played the game, so... Where they come from, from the stat. You have a new shield, what did it actually do? I'm actually not sure. Also, I was... I wanted to check it out if those things will die on water, but I guess not. But they will probably lit up oil. Haven't tried it yet, I need to remember, well, to do that, basically. Yeah, this is uh... What's the deal with this weapon, actually? Is it just a normal projectile? Or was it... wait. I'll try it and... hmm. Yeah, so we have a fire that acts like a shotgun, and we can charge it. Yep. Ooh, right. Hello. It came pretty fast then. And yeah, we got this one. We got the... Well, we got a gate mechanic now, which is really neat. And yep, we can go forward with like that. We got the black hole thingy. That can be... Guided. Wait, how did it, it has to? Oh, really? you're right. It goes through. The, huh, interesting. Okay. Yeah, we got this one. Wait, is this new even? Anyway, yeah, let's go for the second part. I guess I kind of showcased the enemies from. They were from 8, yeah. Okay. Right. And now... Yeah. To this... Second... Part, I guess. So... Yeah, it's a... Uh, two new plant thingies. One jumps and one... Well, just homing missiles. Interesting. 
then we got these guys that are really annoying actually not the best, best weapon for these actually can't this be killed actually pretty, pretty sure no huh that is probably gonna set things on fire again and we got tiny wily ufos and we got owls that drop rocks that look good all right and then we got huh how does this work oh i see interesting huh i wonder if it's gonna push things forward Hmm, hmm, hmm. I got multiple things I need to try out after this then. I need to go and check if the oil enemies... Alright, oh, I have to go here. Now, more enemies. I'm trying to cram all things as closely as to, to... Well, closely together as possible. I hope I didn't miss any enemies on that part. But now... Oh, he has a different entrance. Cool. Uh, I wonder what I placed as his weakness. Was it his, maybe? Well, I think... Okay. Okay. Interesting. This is probably my new favorite weapon, honestly. Just because of the environmental thingy there is okay now I'm probably gonna die hmm yeah I forgot already what I said it as his weakness which sucks so yeah we kind of saw him already also now that you can add multiple bosses yes we get you also can set them to drop items there are some guys certain amount of things they they can drop i'm gonna actually show them after this what the items are uh it was this one for i set here also this isn't good enough yikes Yep, okay. Whoa, okay. That's a lot of damage, what the... And here I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna... Quickly push rush through them without any E-tanks. What was that? This was a really weird boss. Okay, and now... We can also add character changes on bosses, which is really cool, honestly. And we have a sword now, and yeah, it's gonna be the weakness for this one. For random reasons. Alright. And I'm gonna die, apparently, again, because I suck. I actually haven't seen this boss before, so... Probably the worst case I could have had for such a small room of oh, first bo possible boss. Um, I don't know, I'm just gonna do that, I guess. So I can power through the rest of the stuff. Oh. Actually, the sword is really good against this boss, if you can time the swing right. Okay, and you can also set it that, well, the bosses will drop keys, which is really handy. Really good for Metroidvania levels again. And then... You chase her. The bees! I think that the bee looks really similar to the ones in DuckTales for NES. Hmm. Is it? I don't think they're reused, but yeah. Anyway, what did I get actually from this one? Oh, right, I became Mega Man again. Right. 
that was the thing. Anyway, I placed this. Yeah. Also, you can make pretty neat looking. Um, well, landscape thing is here now. Anyway, let's go back. Also, you can have different colored portals, duh. Yeah, that's also a thing I forgot to mention. Yeah, let's just start with the oil tests. So, I did these last time as well, if I remember right. We're gonna see if all of these work. Let's start with... Well, this is a given one, honestly. But hey, just for sake of science. Well. Oh, yep. Yeah. Next. Um, just to check if they all work, because sometimes they forget things. Apparently the water wave didn't work underwater in a way that, well, it didn't set off fires underwater. I mean, well, it didn't put off fires, I mean. Yeah, that's the word. Okay, good, that works. That's actually really interesting. Sacrets, yeah. Actually, this one was something we didn't see yet. Okay. Huh. Okay. That's interesting. So it always explodes at the same distance. Okay. Okay. Oh. Huh. Not what I was expecting, honestly, but okay. How oh, do, do they work, actually? Huh. A block with sumpers, yeah. Ah, reflect shots, okay. Yeah, sure. I was thinking, like, will it kind of change based on the tile set? It's... Well, you know, appearance, reflect in that way. Um, TNT. So if we do this, and... Um, and we... Also, yeah, the sword also sets up fire. Uh, okay, yeah. It, it can start fires as well when you swing the oil, so you, you have to be careful with that one. Um... I mean, it could take gold, do that. Okay, that's good. And... How about... Does rain actually allow fires to happen? Oh, so rain doesn't put off fires. Interesting. I think that should be a thing, though. Will these block rain? I mean, they have a call this. No, they don't. Okay. Let's see. No. Okay. Is there anything that would create temporary tile sideways? Well, actually, this is exactly what I was asking for. Whoops. Anyways. Like this, yeah. So yeah, it will break the blocks. And apparently those don't count as, as well something that will block the water either. Too bad. I guess it's checked at the start of the room or in the editor even. Oh. Some invisible wall stuff or something. Huh. Okay. But... Uh, I mean, sure. All the red ones got triggered, now the green one, and then a reset switch it instantly teleports them back instead of dropping them there. I mean... You think they will, but let's see. Okay, they do. That's really important. So, 
that's an alternative to the keys. Also, I don't can actually leave this part without triggering those, huh? Actually, I can. Yeah. That's really good. Yeah. The boss thing. I completely forgot to show the menu here. So. Yeah, we had the typical weakness thing, but now we have see that trigger options. So, this is the list of items we have. And then we can make them drop weapons, which I actually didn't do because... Well, I don't know why I didn't do that. Yeah, we can set them as... To... Well... Give away the weapon or... Drop it. Boss will no longer end the states on death, yes. Actually, yeah, where's that one? I need to find the... Death trigger victory condition. Oh, yes. Boss, super boss suppressor. Requires that all active bosses must be dead before ending the level. I think they should add like a main boss. Like a switch somewhere. Like when this boss is killed, it will end the level. Because what if you want to have a level with optional bosses? Like Metroidvania thing where there's a secret boss somewhere. It kind of still... I mean, it's a bit of a limiting factor. Although you can also add one of these to the next room after the final boss. Like have maybe a key... Um, like a yeah, key door or something. Or just one of the boss doors. Wily, Cossack... Alright, oh, they added these. So now you can mark which is like a... Yeah, Drop Shadow and Pit Shadow, yeah. That's really ni nice. And the Eye of the Light. Yep. Alright, and you can switch the color palette as well. Yep. Okay. Um, I mean, probably lots of new spikes were added. Actually, not sure if that many were added, but, mm, well. Fake spike. Hmm, a fake spike, eh? Let's see. Oh no, it was a spike. Okay. Maybe this is enough spacing between them that they won't all come at me at once. So yeah. Oh, it actually shoots rockets, yeah. That'd be a shame to miss that one. Ah! Oh. Okay, so it actually, yeah, goes between this spacing in there like that and penguin. It's gonna charge, yep. And... Okay. Oh, it just disappears after that, okay. Hmm, sure. Oh, I thought this jumped, but... Oh, okay, they do jump, but they don't jump like the grenades do. Yeah, from Shadow Man stage. Um, oop, okay, those are too low. Okay, so they just allow you to climb freely, basically. Okay, that's interesting. And then you could put some spikes in the mix, haha, and make the player's life miserable. Yeah, this is pretty interesting to use. Yeah, and if you hit a wall, you instantly die, so... I mean, die, you fall, but most likely you will die as well. Because, well, that's level designers for you. Also, I forgot to... Well, I've seen this one already, and... Lots of people have it as well. But yeah. Um, right. The concrete shot. It's pretty OP, actually, I'd say. 
because, well, you can... Right, I actually... I guess I can show that as well, in case someone hasn't been looking at their Twitter. So, yeah. You can make... Nice. I mean, it, these are such a good weapon. But, like, so many good weapons added on this that are, like... Yeah, they add so many new options and movement. Like, concrete shots. I mean, yeah, they it kind of does the same thing as this one. But it's still a kind of different use case because you need to have solid floor to put this one on. And, well... You could technically dot some spikes while doing this, like if there was... Like, I don't know, three tile gap uh, between two. Does this crush you? Because that's... That might be inter something interesting to... Yeah, it does. Okay. Ooh, second thing. What can trigger those buttons? There's... I, uh, now I'm getting to the interesting experimental stuff here. Let's put this button here, yeah. Can the gates trigger the buttons? No. Okay, and now it's actually blocking the button as well. Interesting. Hmm, that could be used as well. Hello? Okay, they don't trigger buttons. Okay. Okay, because I was thinking like maybe bosses have some similarities to Mega Man himself, like maybe they're the same class and yeah, but no, okay. Too bad. Oop, and the game crashed. Yikes. Well, I guess that was that. Huh. Well, anyway, I kind of was gonna end the whole showcase anyway. But okay, yeah, I guess I'm gonna start editing this video and hopefully get this out today. So, yeah. My name is Beer Frozen. I thank you for watching. And we'll see you next time, next week with our normal popular videos. Popular videos? No, popular levels video. Yeah. So. Bye.